to rock. Best Besties is about to get rockin' today with rock a roll -a. Hey, remember Michael Poelet's favorite band you mentioned before? Yeah? You probably saw them in the previous episodes. That's a bad one to say, buddy. And Jay, I haven't seen you in a while. My twin is also returning. Well said, my DJ partner. I also have a DJ twin. Here she is. Yo, NJ Ella is in the house. Wow, another DJ twin. How delightful. I know, DJ Madsen. Me too. Hey, have you seen? Hold up. Nicolette is already here. So, never mind. Oh, it's okay. I know. Ditto. I'm arriving in the studio to say hello to you guys. Jimmy, Jimmy Mother Johnson. Wow! Two freak out girls in a row? That's uncommon to say the least. He is an American professional auto racing driver. He competes part time in the NASCAR Cup Series, driving the number 84 Toyota Camry for his team, Legacy Motor Club. Johnson Seven Cup Championships, the first five of which are consecutive, are tied with Richard Petty and Dale Earnhardt for the most all-team. From 2021 to 2022, Johnson competed in the IndyCar Series for Chip Ganassi Racing, and has competed occasionally in sports car racing throughout his career. Oh, hi, Bully, from Super Mario 3D World. How's things with you? It's going good, Bullet Bill. Also, I've brought my friends with me. Hello. I'm Furnace Bully, Bully's identical twin. Mine is Prince Bully. I'm Chill Bully, but I'm from a Nintendo 64 game. I'm Chief Chilly, Chill Bully's friend. My name is Classic Bully. I'm Furnace Classic Bully, Classic Bully's identical twin. I'm Fire Bully, the element version of Bully. And I'm Cat Bully, the cat version of Bully. Glad to have you here, Super Mario Bullies. Wow, cool. Hokey smokes! I am excited for that rock concert today! I know, I'm getting the tickets, if I can find them. Aha, found them, they are on my shelf. Well, good thing you did. Agreed, Daddy. Ditto. Can we go up to the room and look for our jacket? Do I have to remind you of a certain prediction of my own? Maid, I'm embarrassed to say, when you were only a f few days old, I announced to the world that any rock music that I knew. I've just been working hard over the past week, like, cleaning up the floors and washing the dishes. I know, me too. Ditto. Oh boy. It's saved by the bell. This is gonna be fun. I know, mom. I'm very excited as you. I finally got to meet Metallica, Nick Elback, Shina Down, and many old early 2000s metal bands. If they schedule to appear. It depends. Did we get here before the show started? I don't know. Virtual Virus. Welcome, Virtual Virus and Virtual Virus Jr. Hey guys, I got great news. Actually, we both got great news. I'll start. Firstly, my friends Tigger and Pooh got renewed for one more fan-made season. But unfortunately, I won't be hosting this one. Ah. Oh. Don't worry, the legacy will still keep going. After all, my good friend Becker will take over the role of the series hostess. That can't be real. Somebody pinch me. I must be in a fever dream. No, Dom. You're not in a fever dream. Playhouse Disney, your fan-made revived channel, basically announced the season earlier along with this change. Well, 
what a relief. And not to mention, Astral even decided to bring back their old Disney Junior channel they had from 2011 to 2013 before Bell Media acquired Astral, and especially before it was renamed to Family Junior during the Wild Brain years in 2015. What? No way! Yes, it's true. Astral just told me earlier while we were writing the script. Oh no! Dobby! You just broke the fourth? Save it, Becker. I broke the fourth wall, I know. Ah, oh, here we go again. Sorry if I had to say this, but you left me no choice. Cue it, Chris Jericho. You just made the list! Oh, bummer dude. Okay then, now let's get going now, to the Rumble City Coliseum! Oh, Mamma Mia! Ooh. Wow, I felt my eardrums from the roaring fans. Holy f this is fun. Exactly. I can hardly imagine that we can hear our f theme song playing. Not tonight, but if that happened. Oh, hi. Welcome to the Raffle City Coliseum. Taylor Earnhardt Jr. and Bruno Mars? Dale Earnhardt Jr. is an American stock car racing driver. He competes occasionally in the NASCAR Xfinity Series, driving the number 88 Chevrolet Camaro for his team Junior Motorsports. A third-generation driver, he is the sons of seven-time NASCAR Cup Series champion Dale Earnhardt and relative to many former and current drivers in the NASCAR ranks. And Bruno Mars is an American singer, songwriter and record producer. He is known for his stage performances, retro showmanship, and for performing in a wide range of musical styles, including pop, R.B., funk, soul, reggae, disco, and rock. Mars is accompanied by his band, The Hooligans, who play a variety of instruments, such as electric guitar, bass, piano, keyboards, drums, and horns, and also serve as backup singers and dancers. And I can see Bruno Mars has got a pass to enter the stage, along with Ariana Grande, Taylor Swift, Katy Perry and Alicia Keys. Need a stage pass, Mr. Mars? Uh-huh. And everyone else will do the same to fund our city. We are a a a a a a a a a a a a a a a We came here for fundraising purposes. Ariana Grande, Taylor Swift, Katy Perry, and Alicia Keys. I know those three singers. They appear in the show. But here's the one thing. Who's Katy Perry? Katy Perry is an American singer, songwriter and television personality. She is known for her influence on modern pop music and her camp style, being dubbed the Queen of Camp, by Vogue and Rolling Stone. At 16, Perry released a gospel record titled Katy Hudson under Red Hill Records, which was commercially unsuccessful. She moved to Los Angeles at 17 to venture into secular music, and later adopted the stage name Katy Perry, from her mother's maiden name. She recorded an album while signed to Columbia Records, but was dropped before signing to Capitol Records. Wow. Wowzers. That's pop culture, let me tell you. And guess what? Not just three new stage performers, but a whole lot more talented guys meeting on the stage. Holy cow. Oh, oh my, my goodness. goodness. Bruh. More of them? Yay. We ain't killed now. Wow. I cannot wait to see them in the entire concert. Same. Since I've never been to a concert in my whole life. I know. And did I see Becky Lynch on stage? She just returned from her match at Survivor Series War Games in Chicago. I saw her too. But I never heard of Survivor Series War Games. This was the concept that the WWE had since last year. Yeah! Arnold! Da -da. I didn't know that Becky Lynch was on stage. Neither would I, nor have I. And I think it's sold out here. It looks like it. It's tough to get in. I could not believe it. Two rows of seats are sold out. It probably must have broken out. Is there anywhere else we can sit? I do not know. I've got an idea. Let us sit in the non-sold out rows of seats. 
Okay. Aru, comfy. Oh, it's starting to play. And now, the moment you've all been waiting for. This is the 2023 Rockville City Music Festival. What's up, Rockville City? Let's make some noise. Okay, I would like an opportunity to give a special thank you to everyone involved to attend the event tonight. Anyway, let's get rocking. Is that Marie Mike? It is. Holy cow! Ladies and gentlemen, the rock band with the most, Caden's Rock the Fire Explosion. Well, thank you very much. We've got some music that we like to give you. Okay, let's get rocking. One, two. A one, two, three, four. Wow, great performance, Thank you so much. Virtual virus. Wow, good job, Kevin. You got the best thing ever. We appreciate it. Now, good show. I know. Okay, folks. Now, time to end the episode and rock on out of here. Well, everyone. We will see you next time for the next episode. Bye-bye. See ya.